Yes, we are indeed on the home stretch and we have an actor, she says, <laughs> in the house. She is she, but she's an actor. Yes, she's been on um, this film called I Know. You, maybe you've also seen her on Hood Rush, but her name is Ijoma Grace Ago. Thank you so much for joining us this Thank morning. You for having me. People have described you as uh, a method, um, uh -huh. <laughs> a deep method actor. What does that mean to you? I don't know what that means to them. <laughs> <laughs> I take my work seriously, and um, when preparing for a role, I actually go external. So if that's what they mean by deep, I can understand. But method is this time it's last piece, um, uh, teaching on acting where you become the character or through the period of shoot or filming the movie you just become the character so if i'm going to be a mad woman i'm actually a mad woman on set all through if i'm going to be a prostitute i'll be prostituting all through so and if you're going to be a nun i'll be a nun <laughs> <laughs> okay so that's it Okay, but Ijoma is married. Yes, I am. Okay, you are, you are off the stage, you are Mrs. Mrs. Oriahi. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. Well, Ijoma Grace agrees my screen name. Oh, okay. And I was allowed to keep it. Oh, Lucky. good for so you. Say, you have a you. liberal husband, don't yeah. you? He is. Mm -hmm. He is. He's amazing. He's a filmmaker, so he understands what. Oh, oh, yes. He's in the industry. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's a director. Okay. So yeah. it's, you it's went easier. to the Royal Arts Academy. Yes. Tell us about that experience. Oh, it was fun for me. It was the first time um, MM was setting up um, a training school of some sort, and she's a close friend of mine. I've always wanted to get training of some sort, still want to get training of some sort in what I love to do. So it was easy attending the school, and I learned a whole lot of things that I never knew I didn't know prior to going to Royal Arts Academy. So it was also a nice experience for me. Nice okay, experience. and you, you started professionally 2007. Seven, yes. So how has the journey been? It's been full of ups and downs, but I, I love I love the ups, I love the downs. It's all part of the package. It's been fulfilling to say the least. Okay. I mentioned the, the I know film. Yes. Um and uh, the hood rush. Yes. And there was the, Misfits, yes. there was a Flower Girl and a whole lot of them. Okay, now you have a, a latest, um, I think. Oko Ashawo, aka that's the, the, the taxi, taxi driver. driver. <laughs> and that's that. <laughs> uh, some name, huh? Yeah, that's supposed to be. Are you the Ashawo in the name of the. the, the... So fortunately, yes. Oh. <laughs> the story is about your husband. Or is it your boyfriend? No, it? if you live in Lagos, you yes. know that taxi drivers are nicknamed Okashao yes. for some reason. I don't know why. So that's what they're called. So the film is about this taxi driver, his um, journey into Lagos, becoming a taxi driver, the characters he meets, and I happen to be one, one of, of the them. characters of the night he meets. <laughs> so that's, that's, that's why it's called that. And so how do you transition from... Uh, being you know this very serious person and then this um comedy like kind of film i i always say acting is a gift a gift you don't earn it god gives it to you freely i was given this gift so most times when i hear people ask me oh how are you able to do this how are you able to play that it's not it's not about me it's about the gift i've been given it's something i can effortlessly do it's something I find that I can do, you know, better than maybe the average person. And you have your gift. Some people is singing. Some people may be a little thing as arranging these flowers. If you find someone who is gifted in doing that, they do it so well that you're, you know, you're, you, you, it's amazing to, to watch. So it's what God has given me. So it's easy to do because it's, it's a gift, it's a talent that I have. Isn't acting a skill that can be learned? I beg to differ. I, I, I am of that school of thought that you, you can't learn it. You, it's, it's inborn. You said that you have it. You, yeah, can, so you, can, you can develop the skill, you can get better at it, but you have to have it. You have to have been gifted with it. I, I don't believe, like singing, I don't believe it can be learned. Some people disagree, but that's just my school. That's that's what but I. But you think. Th but you think singing can be learned? I also don't think it can be oh, learned. Okay. Yeah, okay. I, I I think it's something you have to have been born with. It is talent that God. And then you can have. enhance it. You can enhance it. That I believe. Okay. Now, um, you do stage play well, too. Yes. 
You've been involved in uh, a couple of them. Oh, yes. Which one would you say is more challenging, being on stage or the <laughs> action, cuts, and, uh, and things like that? I get that a lot as well. And I always say none is more challenging than the other. Each, each has their own um, challenges. On stage, you have to be able to project. You have to be able to be larger than life so that the last person on the seat can understand you. On, on television, you have to be subtle, you have to be centered, you have to concentrate, you know, because the camera catches the littlest details that even you, it may be a twitch of the eye, maybe maybe something, but the camera will catch that. So each sphere has its own, okay. its own challenge. Okay, now look at, look at the screen now. Oh. We see oh. the, the, the taxi driver yeah. thing. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what's going on here? Uh, that's the taxi driver played by Femi Jacobs, awesome actor, and that's me. Ooh. <laughs> Trying to that's a June Lady, a very wonderful actor. And some of the some of these are the characters of the nights he encounters as um, he drives characters along. Of the night. Yes, that's what they <laughs> call them. That's a June Lady, uh, a friend of his father's. Uh, this him just coming to Lagos and uh, that's now, Shaka. Now so. I've done some stage myself. Yeah. And I would have said that stage was more challenging because you have no um, second chance to take two. You, you, yeah, there's no take two. Then, so then if you miss your step and that's you it. miss your, your cue, line, that's yeah. it, it's gone. Yeah. But for television, cut, take two, cut, take three. You also, I, I, I understand. For, for, for movie, you can take 1100. <laughs> take I understand that, but. The fact that um, you have to show emotion at a deeper level for television, for film, mm -hmm. also makes it, uh, it comes with, that, that comes with its own challenge. Because you, you, on stage, I'm, I'm sorry, it's not that you can fake it, but you have to cry louder than you would have cried if the camera is on you. So, <laughs> so it's different. The none is stronger than the other. But none trust me, none, none is easy. easy. Trust me, it's stage. It's good for training, for discipline. Most of what I've learned, you know, that I've used in the course of my career, I learned on stage. You know, how to pronounce words properly, enunciate, be vocal, be... You learn that on and stage. And have it in mind that you can't take two. So yeah, you have from. to really learn it. <laughs> yes, and yes, and yes. no, I see you and I see, like, somebody who really enjoys what she oh does. Oh my God, I'm passionate about what I do. Okay, I like but, to but, do but would there be challenges, you know, you know, for you in the course of doing this? There are, there are. Uh, for me, most of my peculiar challenges has been finding the right scripts, the right work you want to be identified with. Sometimes you do it for the money. Trust me, I have done a lot of work for the money and also for the fact that I just want to work. I don't want to sit down. I want to work. I want to do this thing that I'm so crazy about. So sometimes you just do work for doing sake. But the challenge is finding that right script, that right material you know to 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 be part of basically that that's that's the challenge as an actor when you come to the producers the filmmakers they also have their challenge but as an actor most times it's finding the work and also even when you find the work convincing them that you can do the work sometimes they feel oh no this person's able to carry this role this person's not big enough for face so that too is is a challenge but we're, we're getting there so which okay. one has been the one that you did for love of the work. Ah, uh, if I mention, I don't mention this. <laughs> I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. But some, some. No, but stand... which, which, which work have you done that has made an everlasting mark on you that you loved doing so much that if you had to do it all over again, you, you would do it. Truth is, I, I have to be honest. I can't run away from that question because there is an answer to it. <laughs> I, I love. I loved uh, doing Misfit. Uh, it's the film where, not that I met my husband, I had worked with him years earlier, but it was the film that bonded us because for the. <laughs> <coughs> Not for the film's okay, sake, let, let no, but no, it's no, what no. the film caused. <laughs> no, no, but okay. it, it's all good. That's cool. That's cool. It's all good. That's cool. <laughs>